she left behind? Uh, if there are some closet and mostly uh, most of a lot of things are dish plate. It is called a shoki in Japanese, which is a rice bowl or soup bowl. Their dishes, tons. I guess it's all over there, piled out it's everywhere. Over there, kitchen, there are three big closets. Not closet, what is that called? Cabinet for keeping dishes, plates. So these are all drawers. I pulled it up, and this is also tables she left behind. And this is actually a kind of the room in the center of the house. I think I don't know how people are using this before, but we slept in here um, three weeks or something. And this room, next room is just actually is another just a big tummy. There was um, the butsuda. It is called butsuda, which is. She prayed for the dead, deceased ancestors. Their parents, her parents, her siblings, I don't know who they are, but there were big giant, some sort of butsuda and the pictures or something. So last weekend, she took everything away. Uh, she took everything to her house, I guess. And it was big moving. So we helped a little bit. But now it's all ours. Thing is, she left behind some clothes of her parents. And then the, the clothes must be belonging to their, her parents. A lot of doors, shorty doors. And one gas stove. Not gas stove or stove, toyu, it's a kerosene. So, and the next room is also, it was full of steel. There is a full of futon, which is blankets, and this is all ours now. And there is another small drawer, it's all empty, it's a garbage, you should take care of these. Yeah, and this is also empty now. But it used to be full of clothes and mostly towels or something. So I assumed that at first when I saw this much shoki in this house, I thought there must be some sort of restaurant business because there are tons of same exactly same plates, dish, everything. But actually, I don't know. It's maybe normal in Japan. Yeah, that's it. Should we actually now clean up? Ooh. Ooh. It's a hatch. There is a hatch, some sort of. You can, I think you can open it. It's a, it's a well. Not very good. I don't know, it's creepy. It's a well, so you can see the water. And, yeah, well. Just, uh, Beneath your feet. In Korea, we just have a well outside the house, not inside the house. Wow! <laughs> this wood is super old. Wait, there's things alive in there. Well, which one? Yeah. Baba. This is not airtight or bug proof at all. Bug or tight. anything tight. Anything tight. It's. Uh, Literally, we could say this is outside. Yeah. So our house does have a bath, but it's set up to use well water. 
um, and the well water doesn't work because one of the other pipes in the kitchen that uses for the, for the uh, faucet for the well water uh, is cracked and to replace it I have to rip apart the whole kitchen uh, sink cabinet thing. Um, so anyways, uh, there was a fixture in there for the city water supply as well, but it was just stopped off with a little the plug. Um, so anyways, today I went and bought the, the adapter thing I needed to attach a faucet to it. Uh, the faucet then broke, which is great, um, and kind of leaks, but whatever. I want to see if the bathtub works, and it seems to work. One might think that the water would flow into the septic tank or into the sewer or whatever, but it does not. It flows into some <laughs> rock kind of thing just outside the house. Fearless cube? I'm afraid of this. Uh, still, I'm doing this because you are not gonna do this. You can see actually a ceiling, a uh, roof. Yeah, right? Yeah, right? It's say it's, it looks familiar, isn't it? Mm. are made of dirt. Yep, There's lots of dirt. Yeah. It's uh, uh, damaged. One of the big snake ones. Gross. Gross. Human being is not the different with the birds, right? So, climbing up. Mm. Yeah, oh, it's it exactly the same as uh, Naya, but the uh, beans are amazing. Do you remember the Imano sans? Mm. It's like that, mm. and I can see the plaster wall. <laughs> so there is no insulation journey. Sorry. <laughs> you're wearing the you're wearing the COVID shield. Yeah. I think it's beautiful up there. I saw raccoon shit. It was a home of raccoon and snake, I guess. It's uh, pretty, really big beams uh, across the road, uh, across the house. So it's uh, pretty promising. If we can open up this alley and then TLC a little bit. TLC? TLC a lot, maybe. A lot, yeah, to make it. Beautiful. Make it just the house as it is, yeah? Not cover up. We don't need this ugly ceiling anymore. Yeah? We could have a higher ceiling and open up. It, it looks probably much more airy and lively. Brighten up the house. Oh, 